सो स्टूडेंट्स आफ्टर रीडिंग द पोएम क्राइंग इट्स टाइम टू डिस्कस द क्वेश्चन आंसर्स नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट सी द न्यू वर्ड्स दैट कम एक्रॉस इन द पोएम दे आर सोक्ड सोक्ड मीन्स कंप्लीटली वेट शावर शावर मीन्स बाथ इन विच वॉटर इज स्प्रेड फ्रॉम अबव यू मस्ट हैव शार इन योर बाथरूम इज एंटेड वेप्ट वेप्ट इज द पास्ट फॉर्म ऑफ वीप एंड इट मीन्स शेड टीयर्स और क्राइड आफ्टर द न्यू वर्ड्स लेट सी द क्वेश्चन आंसर्स द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन According to the poet should you cry a little or should you cry a lot The answer comes from the question itself According to the poet we should cry a lot The second question is what can you do after crying a lot after crying a lot after crying a lot we should jump into the shower next next question is read the first two lines of the poem is the mood happy sad angry jealous or upset what do you say students the mood is sad yes and upset the next question is in the last few lines the mood of the poet was changed what is it now very happy angry cheerful sad or jealous of course after crying a lot he was very happy and cheerful okay so this was the answer of question number 3 Let's see the question number 4. Are these sentences right or wrong? The poet says, "You must not cry much." Is it right or wrong? This is wrong. The poet says that you should cry till your pillow is soaked. Is it right or wrong? Yes. it is right the poet says that after crying you should open the window and laugh so that people will see that you are happy it is right the poet says that you should open the window and show people that you are crying no it's wrong poet says that show you are happy Let's discuss something more about crying. Where do you cry? What are the things that make you cry? Just think over it that what are the things that make you cry? And whenever you cry, where do you go to cry? Can you cry when you are happy? Sometimes it happens. when you are so much very happy and you are laughing a lot then also tears came into your eyes isn't it which are the things that make you happy you have to make a list of the things that make you happy in what ways do you show your happiness and how do you show your happiness to others so you have to think over all these things all these questions and write yourself in your own words next is say aloud here you have to say these words loudly let's repeat with me dash bash splash cash trash steer tear clear dear dear
शावर पावर टावर फ्लावर मावर पोक्ड क्रोक्ड सोक्ड स्ट्रोक्ड जोक्ड वेप्ट केप्ट क्रेप्ट लेप्ट स्लेप्ट सो यू सी स्टूडेंट्स दीज आर द डिफरेंट ग्रुप ऑफ राइमिंग वर्ड्स इन द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन यू विल सी द वर्ड्स दैट एंड्स विद नेस जस्ट एज हैप्पीनेस नाउ यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट द डिफरेंट वर्ड्स दैट एंड इन नेस Let's see what are those words sadness brightness dullness in the same way you can think some more words wellness cleanliness darkness you can change the words also next is fill in the blanks you have to fill the blanks with the exact feeling words Let's see first one the tourist were dash to see the beautiful Taj Mahal Now tell me students what should be the feeling word here tourist were amazed tourist were amazed to see the beautiful Taj Mahal amazed means surprised and happy the lights went out suddenly i was alone and whenever you are alone i think you are frightened so when the lights went out suddenly i was alone and frightened so frightened is the correct feeling word here he has been ill for a long time and his parents were whenever you go anywhere your parents feel worried so he has been ill whenever we are ill our parents are worried for us so here you have to write worried the shopkeeper was dash when he saw his safe wide open with all his money missing shopkeeper will be shocked yes he is surprised with shock shopkeeper was shocked when he saw his safe wide open next is creative writing narrate an incident when you have experienced happiness excitement surprise you can use the following clues here some clues has been given with whom you feel excited or happy or surprised when did it happen why where students you have to think and write this in your own words whenever you when you experience happiness excitement or surprise Here is food for thought. When you have something serious to think about, then you have food for thought. Food for thought means to think about something. So let's see what is there to think about. Here some food for your thought is: tomatoes are red, beans are green. The brinjal has a crown, just like a queen. Here is a poem, short poem, which has been given. and it tells about the different vegetables in the poem it has been told that tomatoes are red beans are green brinjal has a crown just like a queen potatoes are brown onion are pink carrots have juice which i can drink vegetable makes me healthy and wise so eat some daily with roti and rice so this was a poem just think over it thank you